realized the neighbor was watching that the whole time Joshua Bassett concert yay it's only 8 52 in the morning and the only reason why I'm awake is because I have to go to school you cannot have fun without having an education it's always that it's always that I decided to vlog the whole thing while I go because it should be exciting my sweater my jacket is so loud I'm also really excited for this concert because it's my first solo concert so I'm like scared but also not Cause honestly, I really wanted to like go to the, a concert by myself. And I feel like he's a good concert to go by myself. Here's the only problem. Uh, where it's at is not totally safe. I'm taking my mace and I'm gonna bark at them. Get back. We'll get started. I'm gonna vlog the whole thing. I'm manifesting that I'm getting a selfie with Mr. Bassett. I made a sign that says a Joshua Bassett concert. Check. And then a selfie with Joshua Bassett. Cause I'm gonna get a selfie. I want to be like one of the first few people, but I think I'm too late for that already. So, also, I'm gonna try to extend my uh, parking space or whatever because I'm trying to get there early. I want to get there in time to like be in the front, you know, because I know where the venue is, they have like the fast lane thing, fast pass, whatever. Um, and I didn't get that. So, yeah. Anyways, we'll talk to you when I get out. I have a test right now in my first class, and you know what? Are we gonna pass? I don't know. We'll see you later. And these scars are the stories I tell all in due time. Do it all again, so if I showed up at your doorstep. Okay, that's enough. Would you tell me? Okay, so I'm back at home. Failed that test. But you know what? Nothing matters today but Joshua Bassett. Let me just do a recap. Because I'm not sure what I said in the intro video. I don't know what I said there. Basically, I'm going to the Joshua Bassett concert by myself. A little bit scared. But at the same time, I don't really mind, you know? I kind of like it because I don't have to wait for anybody else. Like, I'm trying to meet him. So if I'm going to meet him, I don't want to worry about somebody else waiting for me trying to meet him. You know, trying to be like, oh, I'm tired. Let's go. I'm going to be like, no. You know, like I would, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to live my youth here, you know? I don't know if that made sense, but yeah, so I'm really excited for that. Also, I'm a little bit nervous because I wanted to get there on like early because I'm trying to get in, um, I'm trying to get a good spot, you know, but I forgot that the early entry people get to go in first anyway, so I'm a little bit nervous about the parking because I booked the parking already, but it doesn't start until four o'clock. And it goes like until like midnight or something, I don't know. But I want to get there earlier, so I'm going to see if I can just like pay for extra parking or... I don't know, because I don't got money to be paying for parking. Like, I'm going to just see what happens and then if I get lucky, then I get lucky. But like, are they really checking this stuff? The first thing I'm going to do when I get to the House of Blues, I'm trying to meet him after the show. So I need to go see like where this back, where the bus will be, you know? So I'm, I might drive there first and then waste a little time. Oh, let me show you my sign. Joshua Bassett concert, check. Selfie with Joshua, we won't know yet. This is a sign, I'm gonna be holding it up because I'm short. It's not focusing, of course. But can you see it? <laughs> if I get a picture with him, it's gonna have a little check mark there. But anyways, it is 11.45. The first thing I'm gonna do though is my pants that I'm gonna wear are really long so I need to find out how to hem them. But I don't have any thread. So we might use a stapler. I'm totally kidding. So I don't even care to put a lot of makeup uh, when I go to concerts because I end up sweating it off. I'm gonna probably sweat it off before I even get into the venue. <laughs> I'm gonna see you guys back whenever I have some pants hemmed and everything and then we'll see where we are with that. It's 12 o'clock. Um, I really wanna get done like now so that I can go see how the line is looking, you know? Y'all, I am manifesting a selfie with Joshua Bassett. If this video goes up, I can't promise you that I took a selfie. I guess we'll have to find out at the end of the video. If I didn't get a selfie, I'll see you in a little bit. Okay guys, the time is getting closer and closer. 
Uh, and I'm so excited. I already curled my hair. I'm doing my makeup when I get there. My hair has like a whole bunch of hairspray in it. I'm gonna take it out when I get there. But guys, look what I made. So I can be wearing them like this. Also, there you can see through them enough, like where you can still look outside. <gasps> Imagine the selfie Joshua Bassett has them on. I kind of want to do that trend where like you get a whole bunch of people to put them on, and like you get a bunch of pictures. Like I don't know if y'all seen that on TikTok, but then I remember that you had to like talk to people, and I'm scared, so I might just sit there like this. I also got this fanny pack. Why do I look like a mother? I didn't want to carry a big old purse, so I can still be like, yeah. You get it? I was looking at the venue stuff and like what you can bring. And I was going to bring my vlog camera, but you can't bring it. So I thought maybe because like it's just like a point and shoot kind of thing. You know how they say you can just bring those? But it says no personal video, audioing, whatever the heck. So, so while I'm waiting like in line for this concert, I'm going to be deleting stuff off my phone. It's about to run out of storage, so. I'm just gonna go scope out the place, you know. See what it's looking like right now. If it's long already, then I'm gonna get in line. If not, then I'm still gonna get in line. <laughs> I'm making sure I have everything, because I do not. I'm a girl, and I'm by myself, so. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Ooh. You guys, I definitely could have came here uh, a little earlier. I don't know, I'm just gonna go for it. Good thing is I'm one person. So like, I won't be, you know. I came a different way today, so I couldn't see like the actual front of the, what is it, the venue thing? So I couldn't even see the line yet. But they got security over here and a whole bunch of cars coming through, so you ain't even gonna see me anyways. But yeah, I'm gonna finish um, doing this and I might have to just record on my phone because they're, I gotta hurry up. next day and since this video is going up that means we got some good clips so first things first I forgot to actually vlog there so let's start at the beginning when I got there I got there like around I think I got there like around 2 I happened to I I, I was asking these girls because the line was already long right I was basically just saying like oh my gosh I'm like I'm scared to see the end of the line blah 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 and I ended up staying with them it was just me by myself so if you guys are watching Brooklyn and Hannah, you guys helped me so much. Thank you for that. Yeah, they were really cool. They ended up just like letting me stay uh, in the line with them. And then there was this other girl too that I was talking to, so. Solo concerts are definitely gonna be happening more often for me because um, I can make friends real easy, so. Which is weird, because I'm shy, but. They didn't open the doors. Like we did not go in until I want to say like 6:30, maybe even after. But y'all, tell me why they didn't almost didn't let me take my poster in. It wasn't even that big, but I snuck it in. When we were going through, where you get the bag, where the bags checked, whatever. They were like, you can't bring the poster in. It's too big. And I was like, what? I was like, this little paper is too big. And I was like, what? So I waited for this girl. I was I'm really good at like sneaking the paper in. I was starting to fold it up and then she was like yeah you got you gotta throw it away and so I start folding it up and she turned around and I 
I zoomed out of there. Also, I had not eaten all day. Like, I don't even think, because I went to school and then I like got hot Cheetos and fruit snacks. That's all I had in the morning. During this concert, three people passed out. I was going to be the fourth one. I am never throwing these glasses away. Well, we're just going to put them on for the video. So whatever, we start going in and then I get separated from the friends that I was with. And I was like, save a spot for me. But it's really hard because everybody was going crazy. Um, I go in and I actually end up getting like the barricade. I'll put videos, but the barricade, but like next to the water. So I was like, hello, like I'm going to be, I'm going to be there. From all the videos, I figured he was going to be everywhere. So I was kind of like, maybe he's going to come over here, you know. I wasn't sure though. But tell me why I became best friends with Mike Ryan, the security guard. I was like, Mike Ryan. <laughs> I was like, do I have a good chance here? Like, is he gonna come over here? He was like, he's really all over the crowd. Like, he's walking through the crowd. And I was like, that wasn't the question. I was like, do I have a chance of him coming in front? Do I have a chance? He said that there was a possibility, okay? So I was already not too, like, prepared for him to be there. I was wrong. I was so wrong. I will insert that video. He he was singing Lifeline. He like came down to the rail, to the barricade thing. And I was letting this girl have a moment because she was crying so bad. Lifeline, it gets you. Um, I was almost there. She was crying, so I let her just have her moment, you know, whatever. And then, when he was singing different, <laughs> he was walking through the crowd and tell me why he jumps over the barricade right in front of my eyes. I like didn't know what to do and I just kind of like touched his shoulder. I was like, hi. <laughs> yeah, and I'll also put that video in because I was just, I was shocked. I was like, Mike Ryan, you were right. So that was a concert that was all, you know, fun. And he came to our side quite a bit. I had to watch most of the concert like through my phone because I'm sure it was still good. Like he was still literally all over the stage. So anyways, cut to after the show. It's 8.54, I have to go to work. I wanted to go meet him like at the bus, you know, cause he's been coming out every show. And so I'm like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna meet him. Like I was gonna get my selfie. Didn't get a selfie, got uh, even better. So, you know, I'm in the front like barricade. You know how hard it is to like get through all these people? I made it. When I came out to the bus, there was literally like the mirror of the bus. You'll see it in the videos, but the mirror of the bus and then like a gap or something. I was still in the front, but to the side. Yeah, I made so many new friends. I met Joshua Bassett. He knows I exist. Yeah, and I don't have any proof of this, but tell me why I had my glasses on when he came out. Tell me why his finger was this close. I was like, he was like, he was looking at my glasses. He goes, oh, he was like trying to read them as he was saying it. And he was like, oh, those are really cool glasses. He knows I exist. And he like climbed on this pole. I was like, <laughs> and then we were leaving because we were already there for until midnight tell me why this kid comes on the bus and starts singing okay so i run back run back start recording i i started so many of the conversations just saying <laughs> i'm just kidding <laughs> he was like singing songs and he's like which song should we sing i was like give us some country and you can hear him like he's like he's like i don't know country songs you know i have videos i'll put them i'll put them all in room with 
the view. Velvet curtains are closed. I'm singing sad songs in a hotel room. <laughs> <laughs> We're sorry. Crying. There's not a star in heaven that we can't reach. Boom. If we're trying. Yeah, so best night ever, literally. He knows I exist. Honestly, Olivia Rodrigo was my number one concert. This is my second best. I feel like the artists can also make or break the show because whenever they can interact with everybody, perfection. Um, now it's back to reality because I gotta go to work so we can afford some more of these concerts. Um, thank you guys for watching. I'm so sorry I didn't record a lot like here, but we still got to meet Joshua Bassett. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe. I just had to finish the video off with glasses. Why not, right? Brooklyn and Hannah, thank you guys so much. Literally, you guys are the best. We are definitely gonna hang out again. We're literally the same person. Have a great day. <laughs> I gotta go to work. Bye. She got me dazing, cause she was so amazing. And now my heart is breaking. And I just keep on saying, baby, 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 oh.